If you want to master the secrets of changing animal behavior quickly, easily, and precisely, you need to learn how to train a chicken. Chickens are the perfect model to teach animal trainers working with any species because they're simple, but they are not easy. They're interested in only three things, eating, not being eaten, and making more chickens. Chickens, especially leghorn chickens, move a lot and they watch and they respond to a trainer's movements whether the trainer wants them to or not. They essentially are a mirror to what you, the trainer, are doing and they catch on quickly, changing their behavior at a much faster rate than dogs and most other animals will. So here's the thing, to learn to change behavior fast and efficiently, you need to practice with something that moves quickly, giving you lots of repetitions. You need lots of chances to make mistakes and change behavior, both yours as the trainer and the chickens as your subject. And here's the big secret, the only behavior that you really have the power to change is your own. To affect the behavior of any other animal, you have to learn to watch closely and really teach yourself to see the tiny nuances in behavior. Chickens really demand that you step up your game as a trainer. And once you learn to do this process with a chicken, training other animals and even people is a breeze. When most people think of training chickens, they think of doctors Marion and Bob Bailey, as well as Marion's first husband, Keller Breland. Keller and Marion were pioneers in the observation of how animals learn or the principles of operant conditioning. In the early 1940s, they were students at the University of Minnesota in the lab of famed behaviorist B.F. Skinner. You may have heard of him. Operant conditioning basically says that behaviors that are reinforced are repeated, while those that are not reinforced die out. So Bob Bailey met the Brelands in 1962 as the Navy's first director of Marine Mammal Program. The Brelands started Bob training on, you guessed it, a chicken. The Brelands and the Baileys used operant conditioning to train thousands of individual animals and hundreds of species for commercial clients, such as theme parks, fairs, international companies, oceanariums, and the military. Much of the work with the U.S. military is still classified, but you can read about one of the most notable projects they worked on with B.F. Skinner, the Pigeon in the Pelican, in which they taught pigeons to guide bombs dropped from planes. It's fascinating stuff. The Brelands and the Baileys had been using chickens to train clients and staff since the 1940s, but it wasn't until the 90s that doctors Marion and Bob started offering chicken workshops to the public. I've been super fortunate to spend time working with Bob on the preservation of their contributions to modern day animal training. I'm committed to helping keep the Brelands and the Baileys work available to future generations so that they can learn to innovate with these universal principles. My chicken workshops are the latest iteration of the Brelands and the Baileys work. The Baileys chicken workshops were multifaceted and very successful and Bob never stopped being curious and improving on them. My goal is to preserve that spirit and experience as best I can. Most people think animal training is about changing the animal's behavior, but it's really about changing your own behavior. Chickens reflect exactly what you're doing as a trainer that gets in your way of producing the behavior that you want. When your training doesn't work, it usually has to do with timing, rate of reinforcement, and sometimes even your criteria. Maybe you're expecting too much or too little, Training chickens helps you uncover these answers quickly. You will walk away from my chicken workshops not only as a better animal trainer, but also feeling empowered to change whatever behavior you want to change within yourself and even others. So if you're an animal trainer who works with animals in open environments with lots of distractions, you work with animals for long durations or distances, you work with a species that could try to harm you or that would shut down due to stress if you used punishment improperly, or you simply want to become the best animal trainer you can be. I'm Kirsten Kraldrevic, and my chickens and I are here to help you master the science and mechanical skills of operant conditioning so that you can create measurable behavior change more quickly, easily, and precisely. <laughs>